Welcome back to Frank Herbert's Dune on the PS2. I'm not going to explain what's going on, because even though I know the story, I don't even know what's going on. Let's just go, shall we? Slowly. Ah, there she is. Okay. I'm going to talk to you. Loading screen. An Imperial Planetologist is going to work in your father's old experimental station. I haven't been back since his death. His data cartridges on the Terra Firma plan are surely there. If the Imperium discover that we're contemplating changes to Dune... The Imperial Sardukars will join the enemy. The Fedaikin Fremen are too few in number to withstand open warfare. My father gave me a special data cartridge for safekeeping. It contains the reports he sent to the Emperor. They're fake and confirm that any notion of creating dry land on Dune is unfeasible. We must go to the station and replace the real reports with these. No reason for both of us to go. Kynes also had a laboratory to test plans for the Terra Firma blueprint. I shall destroy them while you swap over the data. I hope the new residents haven't arrived. I know that Baron has recently made alterations to a Mala gun. It's as silent as a shadow. It's just what we need. Can you get the cartridge and the Mala from Baron's storeroom? I'll see to it. Stilgar should also be notified before we leave. You can do that. I don't think he'll be too thrilled to see us both go. Okay. I have no idea what I'm doing here. I'm not gonna talk to everyone else. It's gonna be more loading screens and loading screens. Now, which one of you two am I talking to? Are you going to do anything about the Imperial Planetologist? Chani will have to decide for herself. Never mind. Is it you? There are more and more Harkonnen Ornies in the remotest desert zones. You'd think they have advanced bases. Nope. But we would have located any new bases. There can be only one explanation. They're relying on the smugglers' help. Staban Tuek won't let us down. Look at all the commission and spices that we're giving him. Stabin Tuik isn't the only one. Other smuggling outfits have less qualms when it comes to joining the Harkonnen. Hmm, we need to investigate further. I'll get scouts into the relevant areas right away. Okay. Run. Atreides, run. <laughs> oh, man. Alright, who am I talking to? Probably the guy gave me the SO speaking. Hello, mother and sister. My very disturbing sister. Oh, wait, where is she? She's gone. She's my mother. I know what you want to talk to me about. I've been told of the arrival of the planetologist. This crisis could prove fatal to the Atreides' house. Whatever happens, the Emperor and the Harkonnen must not join forces against us. Mother, my main concerns are for the Fremen, Kynes, and my promise to him. 
To muster soldiers is one thing, getting your royal title back is another. I will prove you wrong. Paul, don't take any unnecessary gambles. Chani needs me. Yep. Man, I think I prefer tank controls way over this. Oh, there's the Nightmare Fuel herself. Would you not be looking for that cartridge, Paul? It should be in Baron's storeroom. It's hard enough for me to get noticed by my more illustrious elder brother. Let's just say it's a kind of reminder. Moreover, between you and I, how long is it since you've practiced the voice? Not since the Fremen took us in. Precisely. Stilgar's ban. No voice in the siege or its banishment. Mother says you can only use it in times of grave danger. Fear of death must open your mind. I'm fearing death right now. <laughs> it's looking at me. That stinging sensation. What are you doing? She punched you in the balls. I am preparing you. I can't move a muscle. You've injected me with the contents of your gum jabbar. It wasn't metacyanide, but a slower working poison. The antidote is in my second gum jabbar dose. Give it to me now. Aren't you forgetting the magic words? Her Jesus. Um, but. No, 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 no. <laughs> what did I just do? Mother was right all along. You would have let me die. Kill the Quisitz Haderach. You are no different than the hundreds of other souls that haunt me. Now I know why the Fremen call you the Obscenity. Stilgar has forbidden you to use the voice here. However, you can call on it outside the siege walls. When death knocks on your door, it's amazing what our survival instincts can bring out in us. Are you sure you're human after all? Don't thank me for the test. Uh. Holy cow, she can move. What did I just get? Nope. <laughs> ah. Beat Kynes, Chani's father, was an imperial plantologist. He hid in the land. He hid the land conversion plan, which he was developing for the Freedmen's. This cartridge contains the falsified reports that he was sending to the Emperor regularly. It is absolutely vital that the new plantologist finds this falsified data rather than the genuine findings of Kynes, of Kynes on the ecological evolution of Dune. All right, back to Chani. My little sister is trying to kill me. Should I talk to my mother about that? I know what you want to talk to me about. I've been told of the arrival of the planetologist. This nope. crisis nope. could prove fatal nope. to the Atreides' nope. house. Nope. Whatever nope. happens, the Emperor and the Harkonnen must Damn not it, join forces against us. Why do I think there'd be all turn all dialogue? My, my main concerns are for the Fremen, Kynes, and my promise to him. To muster soldiers is one thing, getting your royal title back is another. I will prove you wrong. 
Paul, don't take any unnecessary gambles. Your daughter almost killed me. Chani needs me. Alright, now let's go back to Chani and not... Why did I think dialogue would change after a scenario? I'm stupid. Alright, let's go. At least this hub is small. I can't get lost now that I know where everything is. I have the chip. Oh yeah, look at, there's the water. The reservoir. I haven't finished my preparations. Have you collected the mala and the data cartridge? Oh wait, I have to collect a mala? Not yet. Damn it. Hurry, I'm nearly done. I thought I had everything. I thought I had everything. No. Wait, 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 wait. Give me a second. Is there a... Yes! <laughs> Excellent. Baron, Chani has sent me to pick up the modified Mola pistol. Oh yes, it's ideal for those awkward secret missions. It hardly makes a sound. Okay. A bola pistol. Now we're gonna look at that. Equipment. Nope, nope. Yes. Okay, the mola fires poisoned arrows. One hit is sufficient to kill. Nobody can survive meta cyanide. This is a very silent weapon. Its loader <laughs> Its loaders are highly limited, and its reload rate slow. Okay. Also... Look, the game almost looks normal now. I'm only gonna do this in the hub area. And the save states are when I'm done, because I don't know how the saves are in this game, and I don't want to find out. I have the mola. Did you not want to tell Stilgar of our trip to my father's station? Ah! I I better hope you're him. Can I be of service to you, Paul? Yes. Oh, there we go. Yay, mission time. Chani and I are paying a visit to Kynes' experimental station. Do you honestly think that I will warn you of the danger involved? Chani knows the area better than anybody, and I am the Siege's leading warrior. No, and certainly not alone. We both know that if the Imperial Sardaukars are on the scene, we can't carry out our attack successfully with a division of the Fremen army. They're not ready. I cannot allow it. If we allow the Emperor to find out about the Terra Firma plan, Yes, yes, I know. It's our only option. If anything were to happen to you... We shall return unharmed. When do you intend on leaving? Immediately. Okay. New mission. Now I'm out of that area. The Imperium was not aware of Leek Key's work in the Terra Firma plan for Dune. Chani does not want the secret to be known and decides to eradicate all traces of the plan in her father's station. If Leek Key's scheme were to be made public, all the groups of the universe were contest to the Freeman. 
It's up to Paul and Shani to make their way into Kine's old experimental experimental station. The Imperium Imperium's incumbent planetologist is flanked by the feared Imperium Sardukars. Chani's task is to find the plants of the dry land plan, which are in a secret laboratory where while Paul must swap over Kine's data in his apartments. Do you intend following me around all day? It's a security measure. We have reason to believe that the Fremen have been here in the absence of an Imperial representative. Animals, in one of the Imperium stations. Terrible! Go patrol elsewhere! Man, he's really stretching. Wait, what? What is he moving his hands? Wait, wait, what are you? Should you be looking some more? What are you doing? Do you? What? It, do you want to be looking at the tube thing? No. Oh, okay. He's just moving his hands like it's a keyboard. Mission time? Sardikars. They're gonna make life difficult for us. I'm off to find the plant shoots. The data cartridge should be inside Kine's apartments. This way. Good luck. Uh-huh. Goodbye. Swapping Kine's data. Goodbye. That was so slow. I didn't have to be over here? Darn it. <gasps> yes! Stab, 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 stab. I wish I knew where the room is. Is this important? No. Nope. Okay, there's a guy there. Which... I think he takes the bolas, because I can't aim that very well. You might be shocked. There we go. He's trying, and he's down. Sardikars to boast to the Harkonnen. I 
must lure him out of here. Get him out of there, but ah. oh. <sighs> All right. I'm trying to figure out how to get him out of there. Can I open this door? I can. Oh. Oh no, Chani. Suspicious movement detected. What was... Um, I have no idea what happens. She was running and then... A thing happened? Suspicious movement detected. The music is almost good. It's like almost there. <laughs> Get out of there, plant plantologist. I need to be in there. Come on, stop standing there. Stop talking to nobody. Move. There we go. And now I, I'm gonna leave the other way. Still got one bola left. Because I think he's coming down that way. Take the long way around. Whew, I can have the need for speed. There we go. I'm processing the target. I'm processing the target. gone, I could swap the data, and maybe mission complete? Alright. Where's the data? Oh, the only thing that was like... Oh, wait. Oh, wait. Aha. Uh -huh. Okay, that's not where it should be. I'm gonna go this way. So I gotta crush the samples and then I'm done? Are those samples? No, okay.
Where are the samples? Is he down there? So I know the goal is to let him live. And I don't want to trigger him if... Okay, he is down there. Come on, action. Nothing? Okay. I got one more bola. That's where she ran out of, which looks like an explosion, I think, happened. <laughs> there was, there's no sound effect or anything, it just happened. Suspicious movement. Oh, that sucks. Got to crush samples. Oh. That mechanic is useless. They were very experimental and they had high hopes probably for that mechanic, but for this game, useless. for a few more seconds. If he doesn't move, I'm gonna blast. Three shots. No more, no less. Just three. Are these the samples? Three lines, TIE Fighter with a roof and square. Four lines, TIE Fighter, three lines, TIE Fighter, roof, square. So it's four lines, TIE Fighter, three lines, TIE Fighter with a roof, square. Oh yeah, that's how you do it. station. I'm gonna take it this way. Let me equip my gun just in case. I hear walking. There we go. Give me 
me that for me. back down the stairs, go down that hallway, and that might be my way out. And for elite mercenaries, you guys are weak. Would this count as the exit? Just the front door? Um, maybe? Seven more bullets. Gotta be careful. My bowl is already gone. Right, that guy's last. I got seven bullets. I need three for each. It's three for you, three for you. I should have it in the bag. Ooh, there's an extra. Okay. The way they fall in slow-mo is hilarious. Alright. Alright, I'm gonna... Alright, keep going. There you go. Keep doing your job, you're doing a great job, man. I believe in you. Flight permission not granted. Unidentifiable object. In the name of the Emperor, land at once. That guy is doing a great job watching his location. You keep doing you, man. That was a mission. In the meantime, it feels wonderful outside right now. It's like on the ver it's like high 40s it just feels wonderful it, no offense those wings should be moving like really fast it's called a dragonfly for a reason i crashed i think Will it make it to the siege? That all depends on the will of Liet. Oh. We immediately got very close. Ooh la la. Oh man, I love it when a girl puts her chin through my shoulder. It would have been easy to spot the Fremen hideouts in the desert from the air. All it would have taken would have been some surveillance satellites. The decision for sending satellites into orbit lay with the Guild of Navigators. The Freeman paid for the refusal with an obscene amount of spice. No royal family, not even the Emperor, could spy on the desert. The Freeman relied on Stabin 2X smugglers to deliver the spice payments. Okay. 
that was necessary, I guess. As long as their frigate linked up with the guild's long-haul carriers in orbit, then the Fremen's lair could not be flushed out. Stabin Tuik's frigate has been intercepted by the Harkonnen. How long ago? It's been a few days. We don't know how long the Gilded Navigators will wait before accepting the Harkonnen offer. There could be observation satellites in the sky at any moment. Another method of payment must be found. Ideas are running thin. We have no means of reaching their long-haul carriers in orbit. We'll have to wait for them to land on Dune. I can only see one way of meeting a guild member. The Shield Citadel. Their frigates stop off regularly to refuel. That's a fortified town. The garrison is formidable. Correct. It won't be easy to get inside, but it's the only option I can think of at the moment. Chani visited the place a few years ago with her father. You should talk to her. Will do. Please don't eat the camera. I'd appreciate I'll it. I'll go and see her. Don't worry, we just Our got Our latest the... missions oh. have enabled us to seize a stock of Harkonnen laser guns. Go and see Baron to get yours. Ooh, a laser gun. You're letting me go on a mission without a fuss, Stilgar? I am neither narrow-minded nor am I a fool. The Guild will refuse to deal with a simple messenger. But the Fremen Messiah, whose deeds are revered in the four corners of the planet... Okay, so, yeah, let's not have those satellites. <laughs> Sorry, that light, and I'm yawning. The only satellite we need is a satellite of love. In the not too distant future, I'm playing to. Oh, you look different. You look dead. You're about to go. Me too. What? Has it anything to do with the guild payment? I must meet with a guild delegate at the Shield Citadel. It's a maximum security zone. I once escorted my father there in his capacity as planetologist. He was fearless. Do you know anything about the area? Only the Harkonnen are allowed entry. You also have to negotiate the security gates positioned at every section of the base. Well, that's a start. I have to get on with the plantation program. Kalu will accompany me as far as his home siege. They're depending upon me to deliver a spot of paradise. The weeks ahead are going to be long and lonely. I shall miss you. Be careful. Ah, oh, man, I love when she slow motion runs away from me. Oh, yeah. Put your chin in me again. <laughs> uh. Hey, Mr. Dead. I'm just going to keep walking away from you. Is my sister still going to attempt to kill me? Mother? 
Alia, that doesn't mean you should stop reflecting on the litany. Paul, I'm beginning to worry about the whole thing. Uh, what thing? What exactly are we supposed to fear if the guild are not paid? It will be the final nail in our coffin. They rely on spice for the interplanetary journeys on their long-distance carriers. If we fail to supply them, they will turn to the Harkonnen and the Emperor. The Guild, the Harkonnen, and the Emperor in unison. We would be powerless against such a triumvirate. Oh, okay, that's it. And my creepy sis. Oh, you know, I agree. Ah, there's no reason to go in there. I'm here for a laser gun. Should use the speed up function. Oh well, too late. I'm here. I'll take your best laser gun with the most ammunition that will have no issues. Thank you. I'm searching for the camouflage claws. For safety reasons, it's essential we cover the wind traps outside the siege. I think what we've got here are some Harkonnen lasers. Correct. In perfect working order, too. Have you used one before? Only in training. Which I... that training mission was awful. Are you aware you must never fire a laser at a shield that has Holtzman, Holtzman effect? Unless your idea of final farewell on this earth is an... I know. Oh, atomic explosion. All right, we got a laser. Let's read it. Nope, 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 nope. This is the most powerful of the handguns, but it has a weakness. If its beam hits a Holdsman effect shield, a nuclear explosion will result. It is therefore essential to use it with care. I have a feeling there's going to be an enemy with a shield or something. I'm going to use that and blow up. And when I do, it will be funny. I think that's it. Hello, goodbye. Oh man, nice cape. Alright, let's go back. Slowly. But surely. You think by now they move that boulder out? I don't know. Alright, I'm back. I have the item you require. Let me leave. I'll start and do the next mission and call it. I'm trying to find out when the next refueling stop at the Citadel takes place. Oh. No, 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 no. I have your gun. Let me go. Chani, no. You, no. I don't. I, I don't know. There's not many people I could think. Wait. Okay, this guy's new. Let me talk to him. Training is proceeding well, but it's stomach churning like a storm in the dunes. Um, the head bobble. The head bobble. Alright, we know what's about to happen. Give me a second, and. Oh, okay, I got the armor. Thank you. Oh, that looks weird. 
Which, let's, uh, no, 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 no. Equipment. The Harkonian armor belonged to James, husband of Hera. The clothing includes a bracelet with a built-in code, which allows the wearer to pass through security doors and Harkonian installations. The bracelet code can be changed at the terminals. When Paul wears the Harkonian armor, he must remove his distiller. In other words, I won't be able to uh, recover my magic? Because that's the blue bar. I learned that that's magic? Okay. Also, I didn't mean to like, fast forward to We must move thing. fast. The next frigate from the guild arrives in a few days. I'll come with you as far as the Citadel security perimeter. All right, let's go. Maybe. Yes. You must use the coated bracelet on your armor to move around freely once inside the Citadel. As with all Harkonnen fortresses, you will be stopped at the security gates. These gates are protected by pentashields that are impossible to break through. That is, unless the correct disactivation code is entered into your bracelet. The gates and codes are color-coordinated. The diode's color, for example, will allow you to get past gates of the same color. Be sure to have the correct color code to breach the security gates. There should be charging terminals inside the base, which will allow you to change the bracelet codes. Oh, this sounds like it's going to be an awful mission. Got it. <laughs> okay, yeah. off we go. He had to really think about what he told him. It's like five minutes. Okay, I think I got it now. Yep. Mm -hmm. Yep. Uh, I didn't say anything for five minutes. I know, I was thinking for those five minutes. Got it. Meanwhile, a lady was trying to tell me about her husband, how he passed away, and blah, blah, blah. And I'm like, forgot it. Untoggle that. I love them. They are all overtrained veterans. Have you quite stopped laughing? Um... is completed. Security systems can resume normal activity. And the guild payment. Stabin Tuik smugglers can no longer deliver the Freeman payment to the guild of navigators. The cargo spice destined for them is nevertheless ready for delivery. To prevent Harkonian satellites spying on the Freeman, Paul must urgently meet with one of the guild navigators, navigators members. They must agree on a new way for the spice payment to be carried out. A guild frigate is due to refuel at the Shield Citadel, a high security fortress. Wearing the Harkonian uniform, as in disguise, Paul's mission is to get inside and try to board the vessel. Give me your helmet. Oh! Oh! Well, that was a beginning immediately. Okay, let's do this. I hate to say, I was supposed to be undercover. That was the quickest not undercover I've ever been. I actually do like this outfit though. It's actually really nice. Although now I can't replenish my magic which means I cannot heal, meaning 
Oh, that's awesome. Oh! Oh! I don't know if I need to kill them. Alright, that one needs blue, that one needs red, that one's an alarm, that's an alarm. I got a feeling when they hit the alarm, bad things happen. Maybe. If you let them. You're new, aren't you? Only the pilots have an entry pass for the defense tower, not dog bodies like us. Ah, uh, I see. Ah, you're right. We don't have the pass. I am... <laughs> Whoops. Alright. Down there is no good. That requires red. This way requires blue. But... Mm. I have to start somewhere. Let's see what happens. Okay, nope, can't do it. Does it say which one you have at the beginning? I have to have one of them, right? Objectives, equipment... It doesn't say. Okay. No, 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 no. Absolutely not, put that way. Ah, I'm red. Pathway there is a pathway down. Oh, I think I just walked into the ship. Is that the ship? An orny with no emblem. The presence of the Imperial Sardo cars is making me nervous. Is the flight map safely tucked away? In the defense tower. The Sardo cars cannot get into that part of the base. Let's go before they ask us questions about our destination. Sardaukars are worried. That means there is a link with the stolen spice. These flight maps can lead us to Raban's secret depositories. Got to find the tower. Finding maps to secret base. Okay. Dun, 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 dun. Hello, dear sir. How you doing? Ignore me. I'm just... Oh, is there a spider on your back? Oh. Oh. Nope, it was my knife. I don't know the code. Not even gonna bother yet. Wait, look around, look around. Alright, double checking. Oh, is this the way down? Damn it. Nope. All right, not much I can do here. Loading, loading, loading. Yeah, I 
can't do this. I don't know the code. Oh, that changes it to the color. Now, if I can figure out the sequence, maybe I can get the green. The problem is figuring out the sequence. This one's blue, the other one's green. Why am I over here? Cause... Oh! Oh! Give me a second, this is where I come in. Alright. I got what I needed. Now we'll go take a picture of the green. I hate to say, it's kind of stupid to put your security code on a screen. Alright, now let me take a picture of the green one. We'll do the one we're next to. Alright. Okay, we're doing green. Green, not blue. Okay. We'll do green, go in there, then we'll do blue, go in there, and hopefully it's the end of the mission, call it there. Soon. Alright, I need TIE Fighter with the roof. Four lines. TIE Fighter landed in building. Four lines square. Alright, so TIE Fighter with roof. Four... TIE Fighter and Building. Square.
Wait, what? Um, give me a second. Let me try the other one. Tie fighter on the roof. There. Oh, wait, I missed one. I want blue yet. Sorry. We all make mistakes. Alright, there we go. I want you. I want you. I want you. And I want you. Okay, I was really confused. I'm like, I'm pretty sure I got the right one. Alright, we got green. And then I'm going to need a car key to open that up. Because that's going to open it up when I turn the blue. So I can go through the blue gate. Because I have to go through the red gate. But I'm uh, going to get the car key, which is going to be probably in here. I can have the blue and go with the blue. Alright, let's do this. Hello, man. Oh. Oh. Sorry, no one lives ever. I'm not tempting fit. Oh, did you miss? You know what, man? I wonder if those emergency buttons actually work. I see them all over, but I notice they don't aggro on you unless you shoot first, which that's what I'm doing. But again, yeah, I'm stabbing first just to finish it all and go. Hi, buddy. Ooh. the maps all right looks like it's not over here Make me redo it. Oh no. Oh no, 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 no. Oh dear. I'm not gonna like this one. As slow as I am. As m okay, let's see. Hello, sirs. Ignore me. All right. Is there anything in here I need? No. Don't neutralize. I'm starting to think there's nothing in here I actually needed. Which kind of sucks, because I died here. I did. I died here. We all know that. By the way, I am uh, doing save states for this game. Not often, but when I feel like I'm far into a mission, I'm doing save states, because this game doesn't auto-save very well. And by that, I mean at all. When I load the game, it put me... Yeah. yeah. Alright. Let's trudge through this invisible water back to down here and change the color of my band. Alright. 
Let's go over there. I need the blue code, which I still have my phone. Lucky, lucky me. Which is TIE Fighter with a roof on top of it. And a few other things. Okay, let's do it. All right, TIE Fighter with roof. Uh, that, TIE Fighter and building. Uh, that again, and then square. Should be blue. And we got blue. Well, actually, it just hit me. How am I going to get out of here with a blue armband? Because, yeah. Hmm. Because there's the red door up there, the green door over there. There's a card key somewhere. I need that card key. Hmm. Well, join me in this game of infinite possibilities all right we're gonna go down here i have the blue armband hopefully i don't lose too much hp i have not been down here yet because i still have the images from before so i didn't have to come back down here to get the codes all right i think all that's in here are the codes so there's really no reason to even come in here oh wait yeah, I think it's only the codes. There's nothing over there. Alright, back to turning it to green, which I know how you feel. Alright, green. Alright, green would be... Oh, one second. I need TIE Fighter under roof. Super TIE Fighter building. Alright. So yeah, in sections like this, if I already done them, I am going to speed it up. Until I get to a new place, of course. For this, I'm gonna just do this, because... Oh boy. Alright, now right here... Right here is the problem for me. I'm going to save state. I'm going to change to the Bola gun. Do you guys have anything for me in here? Oh, I did have to kill you. Okay, excellent. Now I can get the right color. I lost some HP. It sucks. But I can live with that amount being long. Oh. Because now I can turn my card, my card key, my whatever you want to call it, my wristband, to blue. Use the door upstairs with the card key. Get to their location. Okay, okay, yep, yep. It might work. Then there's the green location, too, I can actually go through. Uh, do I want to do green first or blue? I'll probably stay green. Go out there and see what there is. Yeah, I should be able to just go up here now. Loading, 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 loading. Man, so many loadings. Alright, so if what well, I think this is, this should open. Wait, what? Oh, it's a tower pass. Damn it, it doesn't work. Okay, I gotta go back to red. Wait, how do you go back to red? Oh no, I don't know the red code. God damn it. God damn it, god damn it. You know the bedroom? Right here. Right here. Let me let me untoggle the frame rate. Right here. Right here. Right here. I now have the base door key. Ah. 
It was in the back room. So, yeah, you had to come in the back room. Okay. All right. It's done. It's done. I also went back into my older videos, too, to see if I screwed up and if I needed to, uh... The red code was there. No, um, it was not there. All right, so blue is... So I'm gonna go blue immediately. Huzzah! And now, I'm gonna go back to normal frame rate. Because now we're in new territory. I'm not gonna abuse it too much longer. I hate this level, not gonna lie. I hate it because I'm stupid. Alright. I want the magnetic pass. Wow, it's almost like you used the correct pass. Things work. I don't know, man. Let me have a sip of coffee. Hmm. Yep, tastes like coffee. Okay. At the moment, we have the blue pass, meaning I can go to the blue area. But also, we also have the tower key. Oh, wait, one second. I know. I'm technically cheating, but... This game's... Alright, uh, it just hit me. I'm in the tower and only pilots are allowed to come in here, so... I don't think I'm gonna be a friendly. Oh, that was a cutscene. Yep, that's what I was worried about. Um... Is there a crouch button? Um... Crouch? I don't want to touch that. I also don't think I should be here yet, so I'm actually going to leave. I, I don't want to tempt fate. I don't, yeah, no. I'm going to go back up. I'm going to go through the blue door. Because I clearly have two new places I can go right now. And there's no way for me to get around that. And I got a feeling that's going to hurt if I try. I, I need to make sure I did good. Alright, we're going blue. So, dead ahead. Metallic sounding sand. I mean, I get it. There's a ground underneath the sand that's all, all dusty, but still. Alright, I have no idea what's going to be in this area. It's all going to be new. But because I have the armband, I should be fine to be here. I'm worried I'll get attacked for some reason, but I think I should be okay. There's one guy, there's another guy. I'm gonna just do my thing, try and avoid them. You, though. Actually, if that guy keeps walking. I love how I'm carrying my knife, and they're not doing anything about it. <coughs> really? You didn't notice that? Okay, bud here. <coughs> um, do I want to open that with the body right there? No, I'll wait. Should be good, even though I extremely doubt that would trigger them. All right, 
right, what's down here? Stop it! The mechanic is so useless! There's a thing down there. The problem is and there's three guys. I'm going to leave and come back here if I run out of ideas. Out of ideas. Okay, that was quick. Excuse me, can I walk by? Please let me walk by. I will glitch myself out of bounds. I'll try my best. Uh. All right, let me just stab him in the before this goes wrong. While well, that went smoother than expected. Who are you? Health? No, I got more laser rounds. A gun which I remember using once and it was useless. For probably who I was using it against. But we're in a new place. That's nothing. Again, the last time I thought something was nothing, I kept walking by a card key in the bedroom. Elevator active. Going up. Enjoy your day. Alright. I have no idea where I am now. Oh, I know where I am. Loading bay is reserved for handling. This is bad. This is very bad. does not feel good like there are weapons that don't have an impact that one just eh, oh god I'm almost dead hey please be near the end of the mission please be merciful I'm playing you be merciful <laughs> you're not merciful are you Neutralize. A very bold Grievous. We had expected such an eventuality. If you know why I'm here, then let's get straight to the point. 
Offering it in the middle of the desert is not exactly very tactful. Can you suggest an alternative course of action for our payment? The Ibad Mountains. They were once used in an attempt at desert colonization. The infrastructures are old, but they allow frigates to draw alongside one another. Most importantly, the Harkonnen cannot track them down. We can make the spice payment within two weeks. Fine, we shall honor our part. You did the right thing coming to see us so promptly. We are being inundated with requests for orbital satellites. Is that a threat? We would never upset our spice suppliers. Goodbye, for now. Yay, I'm at the Guild Ambassador. Now I need to leave the Citadel and find the map still. It must have been quite deep. Spice has begun to weave its magic on him. He could overthrow us. We cannot allow the Freeman to control all the spice production. We cannot allow the Fremen to control all the spice production. Let's stick to our commitments with them for the time being, but let's look at ways of replacing them with one of the Imperium's houses. Oh no, we're about to get backstabbed. Later, not now. Who would have saw that coming? I'm gonna make a save state, a different one. This one's after all my damage. All right, we still got 12 rounds for this gun, and this this gun just sucks. I do not feel the power of that gun. They're like, I'll oh, be careful. That gun's really powerful. I'm not feeling it, man. Can I open this? Oh, I can. Sweet. Awesome. Alright, and everyone's already dead, so this is a breeze for me. I still gotta find the map, so. Or I could just leave the citadel. Maybe. I wish this level was a little more direct what I had to do I'm not gonna say clear I don't think this game can do that um, this level is definitely bigger than the rest but my god that's way more annoying right there's that building with the red laser that I was afraid to walk into then there is isn't there a green one around here actually I'm very curious, can I just leave? That must have been the movie. We will deal with them later. We will stick with our plan now. If I could leave now and just skip that objective and still win, I will accept those consequences. No, you need the spice per yeah, you need the spice maps, damn it. So much for hope. Alright. So the only other thing I can think of doing. Alright. I'm gonna see what happens when I do it. gonna lie I thought that happened okay all right now the problem is how do I get around that because I no longer have the red on me mm, I 
feels nice in my room right now. There's a really nice cool breeze coming in. And I prefer it when it's cooler, but it's like a nice, like, trying to be spring, but it's still winter with a hint of rain in the wind. Feels nice. Also, I'm sorry for if your ears absolutely hate this music. Alright, so the problem is I can't go there without triggering it. And I don't know how not to trigger it. Which is a problem. Mm. There's nothing I can do there. I already had green, I can't do red, and I already got blue. Oh, wait, I might be stupid. Can I? Go, 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 go. No. Yeah, it's this one here. Oh, wait. No, no, no. Yes. No, okay. I forgot! The tutorial taught me how the... Oh, boy. The tutorial teaches you the role. You might be shocked. That is actually a thing. That useless mechanic came in use. Forcefully. I want health. I also smell trap. I want health, please. Oh wait, is this the maps? If so, I can just get out of here. The archive terminal of the flight maps. If it really is an Orny from Raban's secret depot, its flight plan must be coded. Let's look at the code levels with the highest clearance. Wow, good job with that animation. You just still imaged it. His movement completely stopped while he was talking. That one. No pilot's name, no Orny registration, just coded flight data. It's gotta be the one. Um, oh, okay, you have me worried. All right, I got the map. For a second there, I thought my, I, was, I, I, I was Isaac Clark, and I'm like, nah, it's a... Oh no. It's instant death if that sees me, isn't it?
Don't go away. Don't freak out yet. I don't know if that's to shoot this thing. Oh, it does have a target. Damn, you do not aim well. All right, let's hope it goes left. No, nope, that's what I was worried about. I signed up for was something. I thought you had to avoid it until it's done detecting and then it's like no one detected and left. Ends up no, you had to actually shoot it. Wait, are those deactivated? If so, that's gonna make oh thank you. I have to do pointless roll. That pointless pointless roll that they teach you once in the tutorial, which by the way, tutorial not that great. Shocker. It teaches you how to stab a guy in the back, how to aim and shoot, and what puzzles are. And it's like, oh yeah, here's how to roll. But you wanna know what? We're done with this mission. I am the Muhadib. Oh, I am a little tired. But we got it. We got it. We got it. Let's get out of here. I killed everyone here, by the way. Everyone is dead. I single-handedly took out the entire base, or at least this section of the base. I don't know how big it is. Alright, we got just let me leave the Citadel. Also, I hate to say, after meeting the Guild Ambassador, leaving the Citadel should never have popped up. Because it made me think, oh, I have an option to just leave. It you don't. Be alert, Fremen groups have been spotted in the vicinity. Too late. Um, I see nothing but green. Did something break? Yeah. Oh, I'm done with that mission. I hope I never do it again. I'm gonna do a save state, by the way, when I'm out of this, just to be safe, because saves are weird. The route to Raban's secret depositories. This would be the final blow for the Harkonnen spice harvests. The data coding is complicated. We could use the navigation map code manual. We know where it can be found. In the documents room in Arakin Palace. You sure? You're a secret agent of ours has just started work there. 
Hara is taking a big risk. Can you arrange a mission to the palace? Into the lion's den. Let me think about it. Paul, I have some bad news. It's Chani. She has been captured by Desid's smugglers. They intend selling her and Kalu to the Harkonnen. Then there's no time to lose. Man, those subs... Their base camp is a few hours away by Orni. You'll need jamming equipment. I'll go and see Baron. It'd be a good idea to give the flight maps to my mother before leaving. That's a wise move. I'll take care of the Orni. See you shortly. Oh, I'm gonna go see my mother and my psychopath sister. Nice. Also, I love how that conversation went. I'll think about, oh, Chani's been kidnapped. Like, what? 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 All right. Um, safety save state because saving's weird. Okay. All right, Chani's been kidnapped. Oh, no. I think the music in the level just broke. Hello, mother and psychopathic sister who wants me dead. I'm gonna talk to her first. Hmm, so murky. This meaty dose leaves you a few seconds to sample the agony, brother. Do you have the right to taste deadly concoctions? Poison is the aristocracy's favorite weapon. Don't make fun of this exercise, Aaliyah. You must be able to recognize them in a split second. Oh, that's nothing compared to a hunter-killer, the favorite weapon of noblemen. There are ways of evading hunter-killers, too. They're attracted to noise and movement, but they're only deadly when the target moves in their field of vision. Their weakness is the limit of their sensors. Dear Mother has taught you well, Paul. I'm scared. I'm not sleeping at night. My God, Paul. I've just heard the news about Shani and Kalu. Spare me, Mother. You've never accepted my love for a Fremen, who is, as you put it, unfit for an Atreides Duke. How dare you say such things? I do have feelings. What affects you affects me, Paul. My concerns for your future have nothing to do with this terrible occurrence. I must find her. There's no negotiating with them. These smugglers are nothing like Stab and Tuex. They're rogue mercenaries who've been associated with the Harkonnen for a long time. They're unscrupulous and merciless. I love how sometimes the subtitles don't even try to be accurate. <laughs> Look after this Redulian crystal. I'll pick it up when I return. All right, and that's done. Now I should go back. Goodbye, mother. Sister. Yeah, the music in this level is completely broken. It might have been the save state. Maybe? All right, man, I'm here. You better have those, uh, the equipment we need, because I am not going back over there. Because you said you are grabbing it. Did you see Baron and Dame Jessica? I hate you. I hate you, man. 
I hate you. You said you were getting the equipment. Now I have. Oh, oh God, all oh, you get out of my way. I'm sorry, but this walking noise is absolutely hilarious. If you speed it up, it sounds weird. I've prepared you a stock of radar jammers. The smugglers have the disagreeable habit of placing a network of short-range radar right around their camp. When a problem arises on the periphery, the entire camp is alerted. When infiltrating one of their sites, it's best to start by putting their communications radar out of action. All you need to do is place one of these jammers on each antenna. Thanks for the lesson, Baron. Oh, the music's back. Oh, never mind. This game is really broken, isn't it? I got a feeling there's a lot of things I can do to speed this up. I'm not saying gameplay-wise, like, like, there are glitches that will, like, throw me out of the map into places I need to be. Just not talented to find them. <laughs> what the? Um, there's a lot of walking I'm doing. And Orny is waiting to take off. Let's go. <laughs> Let's see. Judging by what I think, I might have another hour left, if I had to guess. The smugglers' camp. Chani and Kalu were ambushed by Dizzy Dizzy's men. The unscrupulous smugglers smuggler plans to sell them to the Harkonians. It's imperative to get them out of there. As Sting Stingler pointed out, it's best to disable the communications radar within the best camp. <laughs> I'll pick this one up tomorrow, because I'm tired, but don't worry. I'll put the rest right here for you. Or, actually, mm, depending on how it goes, I might call it. Even though nothing happened. We'll see. If it is bye-bye, see ya. If not, I'll cut that out, maybe.